Hi, it's Tara Green. I just wanted to talk about the astrology aspects of the week. Uh, so, of course, Mercury has already turned retrograde, conjunct the fixed star Arcturus, and squaring Pluto. So a lot of deep shadow work is going to come up to be revealed. Look over your past, maybe abusive relationships, uh, and do some healing work around that. Okay, so today, the 28th, the moon enters Cancer early in the morning. So we're going to be feeling much more wanting to be at home, much more emotional, much more sensitive, much more moody. Your stomach rules the day, okay? On the 29th, very big, beautiful aspect, the magic carpet ride aspect, I call this as Venus trines Neptune. Um, and this aspect happened actually June 21st when Venus was in Cancer. So now we get another view of it. So going from the nurturing mother to the deeply sexual, intense, obsessive, but a beautiful, beautiful spiritual soulmate connect, meditate all day. I'm going to try and take the day off and just do that. Just tune in. Um, on the 30th, sorry, also on the 29th, the sun trines Saturn and Aquarius. Now that's a really nice, positive, open-minded aspect to like put your mind into the future to try to do some rebalancing. Remember that retrograde periods are really positive times. On the 30th, last day of the month, Venus squares Jupiter in a Christ. So that can be, again, uh, Venus and Scorpio, very obsessive, very intense, seeing to the bottom of things. You can use your x-ray vision to look through anything, okay? And then Jupiter in a Christ, amping that up, okay? So definitely, even though it says square, it's a tense aspect, I would definitely keep using that energy to manifest what you want. You know, Jupiter always brings benefits. Again, doing deep soul work, okay? The moon enters Leo, uh, again, so things, energy is going to be upbeat, heartfelt, positive, strong. The weekend is all about healing and kind of this polarity of war or peace. Uh, maybe you should read the book over the weekend if you could. Uh, Mars opposes Chiron early on October the 1st. Mercury squares Pluto also on the 1st. These are fighting words, you know what I mean? So again, old flames, old conversations, didn't get your two cents in, you want to do that. But on the second, there's a nice aspect, Venus sextile Pluto. It's very nice, positive, again, good for wealth, um, finance. The markets may start to go up. Sun opposes Chiron, so the same aspect over again, underline. Mercury trines Jupiter and Aquarius, again, very upbeat, optimistic. Uh, energy. So that's pretty good start to the month. There's going to be a lot of changes during October. I'm doing a, a new moon Libra astrology magic workshop on the 5th. So please sign up for that on my website at terratero.com. If you want to get in touch with me, follow me on my blog at infinitynow.wordpress.com. I'm on Twitter. I'm on TikTok, obviously. I'm on Instagram and Facebook and all that stuff. So please uh, get in touch with me. I'm going to be live also 